Marlon, I see you out there. Yeah, I got you on my monitors. Can't see, but suck it, man. You know I got. You can't, you can't sneak up at me like that, you know. I, I just, I just went down to your office and radio snacks again. Somebody just sent these to me. They're too good. I got like three dozen of them. Nice. All right, Marlon. Thanks a lot, man. Have a good day. Right? Yeah, take care. Yeah, thank you. slipped on the ice four times during my run this morning. And I mean like, I went down. I'm bleeding in two places. And it was cold outside, so 14 miles into my run, my iPhone died, which means no music. And on top of that, I lost all the data pertaining to what was a very good run. Probably like 16 miles at like a seven and a half, eight minute pace. Total failure this morning. Total failure. Question, does your iPhone die if it gets even remotely cold out? It's like chilly, maybe right now, but it's not like I have to kill my horse and climb inside of its hollowed out carcass to stay alive cold out. And this thing dies if it's exposed at all to the air. Is it my phone or is it iPhones? Let me know. It's not that I don't appreciate this, but I feel like whoever's sending me all this stuff is trying to make me fat. Look at all these cookies. They're from the fancy bakery too. Cupcakes at this place are like $5 each. Thank you, whoever sent me these cookies. All right. I don't know if you remember this thing or not. It's one of my favorite toys. I accidentally dropped it out of the back of my car, um, and then I left it outside overnight, two nights in a row. And then I rode it in the ocean. And even, it still works, but it kind of acts a little bit funny. I described this to the company, and they were like, do you think we know what the problem is? So they sent me a new foot pad sensor. You know, one of the things that Candace says that she really likes about me is how tough my hands are. You can never really trust a man that has really smooth, soft hands. To fix this thing, you have to unscrew eight Allen head screws. And rather than turning this Allen wrench like a thousand times, I'm just going to chop it in half so I can put it in my power driver. Now I don't have to turn it by hand. Responsive, fast, smooth. I completely forgot how awesome this thing is. Yeah, you want to try it? You can try it. Yeah, go for it. Oh. Feel it? So now just kind of lean the direction you want to go. Nice. Don't go too fast. Bye, guys. As an adult, you can't play with a toy in public and not let a child try your toy if they ask, so. Why don't they tell you where the blades are supposed to go? So, what did we learn today? The 
propellers that have the holes go on this side and the propellers that don't have holes and the propellers that don't have holes go on this side. Okay, I missed that. I'm sorry. It's dark out now. All right, I'm back in the park. It's kind of dark out here, but Manfrotto, the company that sent me all those tripods, they sent me this panel light. Ready? <laughs> it's so bright. It's like having a little mini sun. Let me throw a little light down. Okay, so far so good. Have not crashed the drone, but it's above me. All right, pretty impressed with this thing so far, with this thing for sure. Uh, the only thing is, I couldn't figure out how to control the camera. I just watched a YouTube video on how to control this thing. I think I figured it out. You have to use two fingers to control the camera. Twelve seconds later. All right, another wildly successful flight. I mean, I landed in the snow, but all things considered. In a dream world, what I want from a drone is I want total autonomy. I just throw it in the air and it follows me. There's nothing on the market that does that. This thing's pretty close. I was very impressed with that, given I haven't seen the footage, but I don't really care if the footage is good or bad. I just care if it got the shot. Importing the footage now. Really excited to see this. It hasn't imported yet, I can't quite tell, but from the looks of it, it's kind of dark, which is disappointing because I tried to go out when the sun was out, but I couldn't figure out how to. I can't give this thing a full review yet, but I can say it doesn't work terribly well in low light. Oh, that's so disappointing. All right, I'll show you the footage anyway. Thank you very much. Not a problem. See you guys later. <laughs> I didn't mean to make a video about a drone today. I was trying to make a video about fixing things, but then I got all distracted, and then I got all obsessed, and then... I don't want This is the wrong one. I needed to unscrew the one that has the wire in it.